Hi, if you're like me, you know 1960s The Alamo is one of the greatest movies of all time. So today, I thought it would be fun if you pulled up a chair by the campfire and watched it again with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they changed in 2023. Okay, let's see together. Colonel David Crockett is played by actor John Wayne. He was 53 years old when filming in 1960, and sadly on June 11, 1979, he passed away at the age of 72 in Los Angeles, California, USA. Uh, Emil, he's for him? Yes, he is. Then how did he figure you'd marry him? Political arguments don't flavor folks' supper. Nevertheless. He would make them write a scene one way, and they'd say, no, I'd like to get this, and make him write it another way until he wore him out, and then he'd reach down in and out of a paragraph. Flag Eyes played by actress Linda Crystal. In 1960, when filming, she was 29 years old, and sadly, on June 27, 2020, she passed away at the age of 89 in Beverly Hills, California, USA. The brawler. Crockett has brains. Kept it hidden a number of years. You like my Tennesseans, Flaka? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Now, was this fairly... Had you done much before that? Not in English. Okay. But in Spanish, in Italian, in French, you know, in other countries. Yeah. Smitty is played by actor Frankie Avalon. In 1960, when filming, he was 20 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 82. You did. That was David Crockett from Tennessee. Yes, sir. And I ought to know, me and his neighbors back home. So I got, you know, into this not by really choice. I said, sure, how much money can I make? And they said, well, if you hit, you make a lot. Colonel Jim Bowie is played by actor Richard Whitmark. He was 46 years old when filming in 1960. And sadly, on March 24, 2008, he passed away at the age of 93 in Roxbury, Connecticut, USA. If I take my men out, do you go with me? Davey, you know this old mission can't stand up in front of Santana's army. My way's the only way. Travis. And it was Sidney's first picture. I played a horrible racist bigot. And I... Beekeeper is played back to Chill Wills. He was 58 years old when filming in 1960. And sadly, on December 15, 1978, he passed away at the age of 76 in Encino, California, USA. Close together. Want you Texans to open up your ears and listen to a little pure Tennessee. Yeah! Where did did the years go, Mama? Seems like only yesterday. Captain James Butler Bonham is played back to Patrick Wayne. In 1960, when filming, he was 21 years old, and now he's living out the life at the age of 83. Disposed, sir. Indisposed? By God, if you mean drunk, you say drunk, sir. He's drunk, sir. What's your name? James Butler Bonham, in Travis's command, sir. Uh, one of the big programs uh, has been the Sentinel Node program, which was developed at the Yama Cancer Institute. Jethro is played by actor Chester Hairston. In 1960, when filming, he was 59 years old, and sadly, on January 18, 2000, he passed away at the age of 98 in Los Angeles, California, USA. Same age. Yes, sir. But I've been a temperate and God-fearing man all my life, sir. <laughs> well, I guess my past is out. Off you fall on me, break your neck, try to fall down on the floor. Getting out the butchers. She's a different life just for. Captain Amron Dickinson is played by actor Ken Curtis. He was 44 years old when filming in 1960, and sadly, on April 28, 1991, he passed away at the age of 74 in Fresno, California, USA. We're listening. And I can't let that rabble know how weak we are and how strong the enemy is. Did anyone feed them in your family? Oh yes, I fed them. Okay. I, I usually did the feeding, but uh, we had a situation where <clears throat> I don't know if you know or are familiar with the setup of the old. Lisa Angelica Dickinson is playback actress Isa Wayne. 
In 1960, when filming, she was four years old, and now she's living out the life at the age of 66. What am I? And the reason that I'm here to support Mr. Trump is because America needs help and we need a strong lead. Colonel William Barrett Travis is played by actor Lawrence Harvey. In 1960, when filming, he was 32 years old. And sadly, on November 25th, 1973, he passed away at the age of 45 in Hampstead, London, England. And unendurable hardships the people have been subjected to under the tyrannical government of this military dictator, Santa Anna. We have no rights in the court. Juan Seguin is played by actor Joseph Galea. He was 63 years old when filming in 1960, and sadly on October 31st, 1975, he passed away at the age of 78 in Salima, Malta. Good afternoon, Colonel Travis. We have news of Santa Anna. My son and I have... Good day, Senor Seguin. Mrs. Sue Dickinson is played by actress Joan O'Brien. In 1960, when filming, she was 24 years old, and now she's living out the life at the age of 87. Who's this? You say hello to Colonel Crockett? Hello. <laughs> Every size they get to seems to be the most lovable. Will you gentlemen excuse me? Parson is played by actor Hank Warden. In 1960, when filming, he was 59 years old, and sadly, on December 6, 1992, he passed away at the age of 91 in Los Angeles, California, USA. Nothing special. I give thanks for the time and the place. The time and place, Parson? A time to live and a place to die. That's all any man gets. What is your favorite character from the Alamo and what do you think when some actors have passed away? Leave your comments below this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel and press the bell to wait for my next videos. Thank you.